Breaking news after a shooting at the transit center in downtown Appleton, a 14 year veteran of the Appleton Fire Department is now dead. NBC 26's Jennifer Naza has more for us now. She's live from the scene. Jen. Good morning. Yes, what started out as authorities going to help out in a medical issue ended in tragedy yesterday here at the Transit Center in downtown Appleton. As you can see behind me, there is caution tape and squad cars are surrounding the perimeter of the crime scene. Roads are blocked off and the library is also blocked off, different community areas. Uh, there is still a lot to be investigated here. They also tell us that a procession took place earlier today in Milwaukee, where they transported the firefighter's body to the medical examiner's off office. According to police, authorities were called to the transit center in downtown Appleton off of Washington and Oneida Street, and here's what they say happened. It was something that they were dealing with, responding to a fairly routine call for uh, law enforcement and firefighters to go down there and um, deal with a subject that needed medical assistance. From there, police say an altercation broke out, which led to the shooting. This resulted in the firefighter dead, a police officer, and two other civilians injured. And the Appleton Fire Department says the police officer who was shot is now recovering at a local hospital. And funeral, funeral arrangements for the firefighter are currently in the works. Now the fire department tells us that the investigation is ongoing. We will have more information for you as the day goes on. There is said to be a press conference with the fire chief and mayor of Appleton today, later on. And if you need more information, you can head to our website, NBC26.com. Reporting live in Appleton, Jennifer Naza, NBC26. Back to you. All right, thanks, Jen.